<clears throat> Hello, this is Doomy5. I'm doing a tutorial on Hypercam. Okay, here's how the thing's gonna start off. Okay, first, these are for noobs who don't know how to use Hypercam. Okay, first off, the screen area is where you do all your things, like selecting region or selecting selecting region is where you put it, put the thing up, make a box around the thing you want to record or you can click select window to select the window the whole entire window of it and then you press this button called start recording to practice your recording stuff i suggest you leave hypercam window open and make sure that the repta rectangle um doesn't show around the quarter area as well as make this rectangle blink blink and definitely don't put this on it'll slow down your performance of your video next check out hotkeys set up your hotkeys blah 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 if, you, if this is a bad tutorial you go check out another one AVI file this is where you where you want to put your video this is where you want to put your codec this is where your codec is look for a better codec if you have a rough one and then there's sound this is where you put down the sound and stuff other options is where you, you can put your cursor in it or not and this is just your license thing you don't need to really look at the license you pretty much gotta work on this 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 and this pretty much screen area hotkeys AVI file and sound now once you've done once you've selected an area you can, you can press start recording and record your videos and that's how you do it and hotkeys, you click one of these, and then this shows up, and you click a you click a button on the keyboard to see what it is to 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 pick where you want how to how to record it easily without having to without having to click it click any of these buttons. But I prefer if you use these buttons, and then you can go um to AVI file, click your codec. I have a couple of them. I use Xvid to do videos and stuff. It's easier. And sound. You don't really have to worry about sound much if you want sound. And that's pretty much it. And once you've done select a region, you can make a box like so. Like a like for example, like this. And then you put it around your layer and then you get the thing. But what I'm doing here is I am what I'm doing is I'm allowing you with select window you select you can select like a the, bo the whole box or something and then record the whole thing easier and that's how that works if I've repeat I just repeated this so you know and that'll be it bye